Yeah, man, so said I was going to do a video on these lands, man, that I met, doing research on, you know what I mean, um, for no more suits. I'm a, we have a position um, called a restoring, you know what I'm saying, like uh, at no more suits, and I'm taking on that position. I've been taking it on, you know, really since, you know, we found it no more suits, and um, I just want, you know, kind of take you on a, a journey real quick through, um, you know, just my my life and also like our, our ancestors' lives and, you know, who you are and the tribes, you know, we talk about that and um, you see a lot of information that's coming out about, you know, the indigenous Naga, you know what I mean? These aren't things we were brought up you know we we was brought up you know kind of joking about it like you know they say every black person got a little bit of cherokee in it and like as if we didn't identify with cherokee already you feel what i'm saying like and shiraki is home that's that's what we is you know what i mean so shiraki this is the shiraki lands you know what i mean all homage to the Shiraki. And so, um, I started really getting in tune with self. Um, really, it was like in 2018, late 2018. This is the deer. We call this the common area. It's where the deer, they come out here during the winter time. You got the cranes. So, you know, the cranes, that's the Jehuti and Medanecha. Jehuti. They come out here in masses. I mean, this pit right here, this is a deer's pit. That's where they come and eat. You know what I'm saying? They come and eat. They come see. You know what I'm saying? So we doing real research. You can see the footprints in there. See the butterfly? So you got the deer out here. You got the cranes. You got the cardinals. This is the common place. The common er area. You know what I mean? So, just imagine this Africa. You know what I mean? Like, this could be Indonesia. You know what I mean? This could be, um, you know, along on the other side of these trees. You see that illumination? That's water. That's the Hawassi. That's the mouth of the Hawassi. And, like, just look at this like a street. Look at it like an avenue. So that avenue take you to North Carolina. You know what I'm saying? That's the Cherokee Avenue. It take you to Georgia. You know what I'm saying? The Georgians. You know what I mean? I love this tree, man. These trees. This tree right here. Um, the other day, a bird went and flew to the peak of it. At the very top. Dead center. You know what I'm saying? So, um, you know, we... We doing restory, you know, um, our ancestors are buried in these lands. These are their lands. They walk these lands, you know what I'm saying? They taught on these lands. So, um, you know, we've just been doing real research. And like I said, 2018, I um, really found, I read an article in my hometown, Shalom. We call it Dari Shalom. The Dishalam and um and the Dishalam um you know we had a community or uh, uh side of town neighborhood called Liberia. You know what I'm saying? This is post uh antebellum period, you know, before the civil war, before um colonization, before settlers um came to our territory we had occupied that space for tens of thousands of years and shalom along the yakin valley near the muddy creek so i've been discovering this it's been an own um going discovery investigation um on the real shalom and the people that did shalom prior to the antebellum you know what i'm saying and um it's been a journey uh, you know, it's just really tapping in the self. 
you tap in itself. And um, I actually went to Liberia, um, which is called the Happy Hill Community now. But before it was called the Happy Hill Community, it was called Liberia. Liberia. And so we talking Liberia. Now we got to go to the uh, Negro Jews who were in Liberia. You know what I mean? We got to talk about the Mandingo. You know what I'm saying? And uh, the I have three book references that talk about Mandingo culture in Shalom. You see what I'm saying? So the Jew and Negro is because it was you. And you didn't come over here as a slave. You know what I mean? The prophet noble Drew, uh, Drew Ali said we need to eat, eat off our, our own vine and fig tree. You know what I mean? So, like, um, man, you see that? I'm going to keep this. I'm definitely going to keep this. I got to. And I got to take good care of it. You know what I mean? It's heavy. That's my old earth. You know. So, Prophet Noble Drew Ali said we got to eat off our own fig tree. You know what I mean? Our own pine trees. You know what I mean? And so I've been healing, man. Like, I, I came to these lands not only to be a restorian, but um, part of being a restorian you can't be a restorian if you don't heal yourself. So you have to heal yourself. You know, we, uh, you know, I want to leave my review on uh, Queen of Fools' uh, 21 Day deep Detox, man. We did that, you know what I'm saying? Cleansed our souls, renewed our mind. And like when you take that green life in the morning, you know what I'm saying? Like, you're not going to want to go eat meat. <laughs> It ain't going to be no, how do I go without eating meat? You're not going to want to. So now your brain, it's like how Robert Kiyosaki, uh, Kiyosaki say, um, how can I afford it? How can I, what can I eat? What can I intake in my body? You know what I'm saying? Um, and like, we just keepers of the cold. We not perfect. I'm not perfect. You know what I mean? I grew up around Bojangles. Bojangles, Bojangles Wendy's Burger King was on the corner, on my corner. On my street corners. You know what I mean? And so when you hungry and you only got four dollars in your pocket, you gotta go get the four for four. Can I borrow twenty seven cent? You know what I'm saying? However, it's like when you uh ain't no Burger King joint around here. Ain't no Burger King joint around here. You know what I mean? It's deers that live around here and they eat grass. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? The deer eat grass. So Deuteronomy in 11 say, uh, I'm going to fill your fields with grass so that your cattle can eat and be full. You know what I mean? That's Capricorn energy. I seen the, I seen the goat on earth and in heaven this week. And this is a fact. You know what I'm saying? That goat came up to me. He walked up to me and looked at me as if he knew my arrival before I came. You know what I'm saying? Or as, or as if my arrival signified a code for him. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and then to keep it gangster, right after we cut the corner from seeing the goat, we seen Nicki Minaj on the flag saluting. So the flag out here in these lands is Nicki Minaj. You feel what I'm saying? Nicki Minaj is on the flag out here in these lands. That's the flags that's flying in these lands. We uh, On the river, they was playing Maya Lahi, Maya Lahi, oh, just live your life. They was playing that, you know what I'm saying? On the Hawassi, the Hawa, Hawa. So... Now, again, like I said, that's an avenue. You feel me? These trees is like, look at it like a storefront on the avenue. So we like in the back area, you feel me? Behind the, the trees, just look at the trees like a warehouse or a storefront along the avenue. You know what I mean? If we in New York or, 
East shit, Winston, you know, these, this is the back alley, you feel me, we on the back alley, and, um, you go down that avenue, you gonna run into Hawashi Island, now, I'm gonna tell y'all some shit, the people, our people, the real people, have been occupying the Hawashi for tens of thousands of years that we know about that we know about you know what i'm saying that's just what we can comprehend you know what i mean um but it, it's probably way longer than that you know what i'm saying um and sam houston who they say was half breed cherokee grew up on that island Look up Hawashi Island. Look up the Hawaii and look at the how they dug up our burial mounds. You feel me? How they dug up our, you know what I mean? I don't know if Big Mama gave them permission to do that. You know what I mean? Um, and so that leads to the next point. Um, in 1835, from like 1790 to 1835 a lot of events occurred you had the um french and indian war that was going on to Kumsey, who was coming from my mama turf lands you know what i'm saying uh, came down here to partner up with the chickamauga chickamauga the chickamauga was was the cherokee you know what i mean so now you're looking at ancient kemet and how um, in ancient Kemet, you got upper and lower Kemet. You know what I'm saying? Um, so when they say uh, they go up south and down north, you know what I'm saying? So you go up south. So upper Kemet, or uh, upper Kemet is where Egypt or Ikupata is, and lower Kemet is where Ethiopia and the Sudan is. You feel me? Uh, so you looking at that now? You looking at Kentucky and um, Tennessee or Tunisia. <laughs> so um, we had warrior camps in Lower Egypt, you know what I mean? And in Ethiopia, in the Sudan, and in the in ancient Kemet, you had the Medja. You feel me? Or Maja or the Maj the Maja warriors. And in modern times you got the Chikamanga. You know what I mean? But then you also gotta go to ancient Scotland. Because the ancient training camp in the um in Kemet was at Abu. Abu. Abu Dos. You know what I'm saying? And in Scotland. The warrior chant for the indigenous tribes who was, you know what I'm saying, defending that uh, seal, Solomon seal. <laughs> they war chant was Abu. Abu. So we talking Shaba. <laughs> the Shabaka stone. <laughs> You know what I mean? So you got to piece all of this together. And here you had Chikamanga. So Chikamanga was like, y'all out here signing deals with these hybrids and shit. They ain't got shit to do with your land. And then look, cause little cousin Ray Ray and Jojo, they live over there. So if you sign that motherfucking treaty, cuz, they not going to have nowhere to stay. They ain't going to have nowhere to eat. They ain't trying to go to Oklahoma, cuz. You know what I mean? So it's like, and then it's like, but they saying that if uh, we don't stay, then they going to they gonna what? You feel what I'm saying? We going to pop off. That's what the fuck was going on out here. You feel me? Look at the uh, Chickamauga battle. The battle of Chickamauga. You know what I mean? They did tell the rest of the story. So you had, um, and then look at that treaty of uh, Fort Wayne, where we sold off over 30 million acres of our land, of our territory. You know what I mean? So we got to really look into this. And so now, um, 
All of this stuff parallels. Now, so I said you got that avenue, right? That's the Hawaii. Like, we at the mouth. The mouth is over here. You know what I'm saying? And this piece of land is a huge. I mean, you driving on this land for miles, miles and miles and miles. You feel me? Just on this section. You know what I mean? This is um, what you would call a village. And there's land available out here. You know what I'm saying? For it needs to be preserved for the Shiraki, the original people. You know what I'm saying? This land needs to be preserved for the original people. You know what I mean? Um, so that they can be amongst the deer. And the deer have fear uh, from humans because we're killing them. You know what I mean? We're not supposed to kill them. If we do, it's supposed to be a sacrifice. It's supposed to be sacrificial. You know what I mean? Like with the buffalo, the buffalo gave their life to us. You know what I'm saying? Because they understood what was going on. We was isolated from where we could yield crops. You know what I'm saying? And like, you know, like we were isolated from where we could yield crops. So, um, mama, nature was like, we're going to give the buffalo, you know what I'm saying, spiritually, so that the buffalo, like, yo, we love you so much. We love what y'all doing so much. We're going to give you our life so that you can take on our life as well, and we can continue this cycle of life, you know what I'm saying? So, that's, that's, uh... That's sacred. If you don't have nowhere where you can grow and eat off of the land, you know what I mean? Like here, you could put a garden right here and grow and yield crops. You know what I'm saying? So now, um, you know, just connecting this back to the, the I call Portland, Portland, Oregon. That's the port of origin. <laughs> port of origin. You know what I mean? So right here is river would take you to my point, my port of origin. And you can see, like, these lands are sacred. These lands are sacred. You know what I mean? Um, they say that TVA um, owns the land on the river. Or yeah, How does that work? So I want to call TVA out, and I'm like, okay, if y'all own this water, make it rise, like Mo say. Make it rise, like, we're going to challenge TVA. If y'all own this, make the water rise. Let's have an event. You come out, you make the water rise. No. <laughs> now you, you, got, you got me calling them all Reese's, man. <laughs> it's your mama territory. You know what I mean? Your grandmama, your granny, your granny, granny, granny was in these woods. You know what I mean? They were walking these lands. I'm just speaking to my original novice. You know it's a lot of time foolery that then happened to us. So like when we sold them lands out, we sold ourselves out because we is the land. You know what I mean? So now we went to the slaughterhouse and got butchered up and shit. You know what I mean? We got butchered up. We, we don't even know. They labeling us as dead and we don't even know it. You know what I mean? Like when I first realized that I was dead, I, I ran from that thought. I'm like, no, nah, ain't no way. You know what I mean? Because it's like, it don't matter what you do, right? It don't matter what you do. It don't matter what you say. It don't matter how you say it. It don't matter how cool you is. It don't matter how many, how many people remember Kobe right now. You know what I'm saying? They not speaking on Kobe name no more and what he was doing. Kobe died on my birthday, man. You know what I'm saying? Nip Nipsey died on my niece's birthday. And she part of the reason why I know about Nipsey. My first time hearing Nipsey was in California. You know what I mean? Was in LA. Bitch, you bro, shut up. Don't talk to me. <laughs> Man, that was 013. You know what I mean? So, you know, this is just, I wanted to, like I said, I'm a restorian for No More Suits. And what a restorian is, it's like, you know, it ain't the his store. It's, it's our store. And we got to, what are we going to do with the history? 
You feel what I'm saying? We got to restore with the history. So we got to restore and get that back to her. So it could be her story. So we're going to take it from his and we're going to give it to her. You feel what I'm saying? You see how that works? You ain't you an exchanger. So we're going to take his story and get that back to her because that's mama's. You know what I'm saying? Shalom, that's mama's. Y'all can call that uh, Winston-Salem a his story, but that's mama's shit. That's my mama shit. You know what I mean? Now that's my mama shit. You know what I mean? So Deuteronomy eleven. You know, so man. You know what I mean? So the Hawashi Island, yeah, Sam Houston. I said a lot in this joint. Look it up. Sam Houston been out here. You know what I mean? That's what they named Houston and then like you know, even down in Texas, like, all of that shit was connected. You know what I mean? Miracle. Because we are the own mix, right? So let's talk about what happened with the Border Patrol. So it's like, you got to look up that Treaty of Guad Guadalajara. It's like, shoot, they hungry? You know what I'm saying? Um, give them some cheeseburgers. And in exchange, we're going to get the border. We're going to get the Del Rio or the Rio Grande. You feel what I'm saying? We're going to get that Rio Grande. So everything on this side of the site, like, uh, it's like this. We marking our territory right here. It's the Rio Grande, right? It's the Rio Grande right there, man. You know what I'm saying? And on the other side of the Rio Grande is Mirko. You know what I'm saying? Or a Mexum. So if right now I'm looking down south. That's south. So it's south. So that's Mexico. This is this Texas. You feel what I'm saying? So... What they did is like, all right, um, you know, um, you can cross these. You used to be, you could cross these bridges. You know what I mean? You could take the ferries from over here to over here. But now uh, the United States Union Corporation is saying, um, we're going to put a border patrol right there. You feel what I'm saying? So now you got to have our shit to come over here. You know what I mean? Treaty of Guadalajara. We signed off on it. $10 million, I think it was. $10 million. I said, all right. You know what I'm saying? That's a drug transaction. That's what treaties are. You get this in exchange for this. Bill of exchange. Mm-hmm. So that's what a treaty is. And that's what happened here, 1835. The same difference. they like... Um, if you stay on this land, you got to become a United States citizen. <laughs> you got to become a United States citizen and participate in United States citizen activities. You got to go to church. You, you know what I'm saying? You better go to church. You know what I'm saying? And then like in my hometown in Shalom, the biggest thing that happened, they said in the 60s, 4,000 families was moved from their villages. Like Liberia. Right. It's not that far off. You know what I'm saying? They was moved from their villages. This is just inner territorial. It's not like how the Cherokee here went from, which we all are the same tribe. We all from the same root. We all from that tribe of Judah. You know what I'm saying? So it's like the Cherokee is the Ethiopians. So it's like the Cherokee here was the Cherokee there. And this river right here. That avenue would get you from Tanasi or Tunisia or Tunisia to North Carolina or Algier <laughs> or the Niger. So this like the Niger River. You know what I'm saying? Because that would take you in inland to Ma. They had the, instead of the gold mines, they had the silver mines. You feel what I'm saying? In North Carolina. So the Shiraki. So now we're talking. Gotta mention Dragon Canoe. <laughs> you feel what I'm saying? So he probably took his canoe from Murphy City. Because they said he came from the Cherokee. You know what I'm saying? From North Carolina. So he probably took Murphy City. And came all the way down. To the Hawassi. And was probably greeted by the matriarchs. Who was probably sitting along the Hawaii, at the Hawassi Island. So when you come in welcome and now it's like you may enter the Tanasi you may enter the Tanasi because the Tanasi river 
is right there. It's it's down yonder. It's really down this way, and it's going down that way. You know what I'm saying? So you you know you get praises because you get praises because we still here living and breathing because of that. You know what I'm saying? Because of that. You see that little gray area, bluish gray area? That's the other side of the river. That's what they call the Hebrew. The Hebrew. You know what I'm saying? So it's like a, a tribe a tribe just came over here and greeted me. Hello. We come from the other side of the Hebrew. Or the Hebrew. The river. The Etera. The Ava. So we... Oh, and they the Moors from across the Rava. So you talking Morava? <laughs> Moravia? We would like to settle on your lands. In exchange, we help to improve the lands. This is more, this is inner tribes. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And our kids can grow up with your kids, and your kids can grow up with my kids. And they can play and run through these trees and forests along the deer. The baby deer, they be about this big. They be running through here. This is their playground. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? This is their playground. And like I said, I'm I'm looking to, you know, I've been out here for three months. And my study time is um, for this segment is almost done um, because we're going to move to the next territory. Um you know what I mean? This is what we do. This is what we do. You know what I mean? This is uh, the element of making a book. You know what I'm saying? Like, um, you you actually got to come out and walk and be among, invest time amongst these lands. You know what I'm saying? Our people are out here. I seen some moors today. And when I say moors, I'm talking about the Shiraki. The moors are the Shiraki. Let's don't get it. We talking about the Shiraki moors. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, don't get us. We're not no dirty moors. No, we birthright moors. <laughs> natural heirs. We've seen some natural heirs to the land today. You know what I'm saying? Indigenous heirs to these lands. So, it's like, um, you know, it's, you hear people out on the boats. It's culture here. And like I said, you know, the... Look up the Magi warriors. So is the my thing is, is the Magi, is the Magi the Chickamauga? <laughs> is the Magi the Chickamauga? Right? The magicians, you know what I mean? So, um, and I just close with this, like, all that stuff that was happening over there in Africa and Istanbul and um, Granada, Spain, and um, Troy, and Egypt, and their Israel that was founded in the 1950s and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, all that stuff didn't happen. It happened here later. You know what I'm saying? Like, there's a book, Barry, uh, not, not Barry Fell, but uh, what do they got? Ramses II in his time. They got a statue of... Uh, uh, of Ramses the second in Memphis. All I gotta do is go down the Tanisha River and go up through Jackson. You know what I'm saying? Cut off through Jackson and cut down to Memphis. You know what I'm saying? That's it. If I want to go by river, you know what I mean. And they got uh, I forget the uh, the name of the look up the biggest mound in Tanisha or Tanisha, Tennessee, Tanisha, Tennessee. You got ta is love. Like you got ta Mary, ta Mary. You know what I'm saying? You got ta Mary is America. The ta Mary, you know what I'm saying? They said they loved their mother's land so much that they um, named it after her. The love for the mother. Mary, ta Mary. You know what I'm saying? Who is Jesus' mother? Marika. All right, man. <laughs> All right, now. So I don't have my books with me. I would pull my books out in abundance, but they're out here amongst me. So, you know, I'm reading. They, you know, reading about these lands, and I'm, it's it's nothing like being on the land. You know what I mean? Um, 
you who do you know from my culture that went into these indigenous lands and talked to you or talked to you from these lands no we always go over to africa and egypt <laughs> you know what i'm saying and do the little uh <laughs> come on man meanwhile the birds is out here sitting on top of this pyramid this is their pyramid you know what i mean the sky i could tell you what's in the sky so we looking at the sun right now the sun is in um gemini shifting to cancer so we got cancer right here you know what i'm saying and then you shift on down you got the lion you feel me the lion the lion is right here yep so i mean the verb the virgin is on the rise and the virgin stretches out and then you have libra right here you know what i'm saying down across these this area right here so this is your arch so now we looking at like the sun is right there that's probably like the eighth it's probably like the seventh house and then you stretching down you're going across you're going across that's the eleventh house over here you feel me so this is how our ancients saw the sky and then it goes across and down yonder it's gonna go down 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 to the seventh so this is like the seventh eighth now you're seeing like the ninth uh the seventh and then the sixth and then by the time it goes into the sixth it's going to descend into the fifth when it descends into the fifth that's when the sun sets you feel what i'm saying so um it's a lot of stuff uh the other night there were uh you know i thought there were um this could have been multiple things happening that was um i want to say the 20th or the 21st i, I can't remember but they had the sky was just like lightening up like like uh infinite supply of lightning was in the sky and it wasn't making no noise and so at first i was like oh they want they having a um a star war you know what i'm saying it's star war or uh outer galactic wars um or out of the planet wars however you will call it extraterrestrial extraterrestrial like things like that but it was actually inside of our atmosphere you know what i'm saying um it was on the inside so they were like in the clouds and so then i was like maybe it's a celebration you know what i'm saying for the jubilee year you know what i mean like the fourth of july and um you know i that was you know i've, I've really been getting in tune with these lands you know what i mean and they are in tune with me i come out and speak to these land these trees these plants these animals you know every day every day so um Minchu hotel and the medjai um is the a good book reference um winston salem and history you go read that but you have to read that book on code like um you really have to read that book on code because he throws a lot of stuff in there like how he say that the Shiraki went missing, gone. Where they at? Here they are. <laughs> Here they are. <laughs> See the eye? <laughs> Whew. I said I made the moon my eye. You know what I mean? So. Whew. Deuteronomy 11 is another reference. 1 through 32. I've been reading that every day for the last five days that's a assignment from big mama you know what i'm saying the most high she, uh, she gave me that assignment you know what i mean we I, uh, man when i tell you i walked with the most high i talked with the most high you know what i'm saying she left messages for me, you know what I mean, to give to y'all, my people, and say, go back, these are the lands that I swore unto your forefathers. <laughs> you know, Deuteronomy 11, ancient and modern Brits, because in there, I'm gonna, I wanna document what I've studied. Okay, 
first of all, they talk about the Morava and um, it references the origin of the Morava and how the Moors by the Rava is the Moravians. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So now we're talking Shalom. We're talking Tennessee because guess what? Shalom is by the Yakin River. You know what I mean? That's shout out to um, um, Alkaline, Live Alkaline Water. They get their water from that original source. Original source. We still getting water from the land. You know what I mean? In the Yakin Valley. Okay? And then you out there, you got the Raddick River. You know what I'm saying? That's the, like where Moses, I mean not Moses, but um, Abraham and Mount Arat, um, A-R, A-R-A-T, Aratic. That's near Pilot Mountain and Mount Nebo. Is that where the ark landed? <laughs> look up Mount Nebo, North Carolina. And then look up Bethania. Look up Badabra. And look up the etymons of those words. And look up Shalom or Salem. So when you have uh, the Negro Jews, now you're talking Hebrew. So Hebrew for Salem is Shalom. So who was our Melchizedek? These are questions that you got to ask. Okay. And then if we talking Melchizedek, now we talking David. So who was our David? If we talking David, now we talking Solomon. So who was our Sheba? Who was our Sheba? The, who was the queen of Sheba? And where was she from? You know what I'm saying? And then you look the, the Magi. So now you connecting the army with the throne, the crown with the throne, you know what I'm saying? The chamber of commerce with the throne, the department of transportation with the throne, with the crown. Kings don't wear crowns, they pass them down. Oh, oh. Kings don't wear crowns, they pass them down. Uh. Uh, they said I was the class clown, but who laughing now? <laughs> Technically, that's me. I'm on the Hawaii. Uh. Okay, so all praises to the Hawaii. Y'all look up the Hawaii. They got a book called Hawaii Island. I think it was published like um, in the 20th century. Or whatnot, it talk about that. It's a lot of drop on Sam Houston being out here. You're gonna see their excavations of the land, like they really, you know, what I mean, you're not supposed to be, you know. So, again, like how they doing in Egypt, they doing it out here. You feel what I'm saying? And it's like our people, we get blinded, distracted, you know, what I mean, we out here doing tours, you know, what I'm saying, drunk, getting drunk, and it ain't nothing wrong with that. However, it's like while you doing all that, they doing excavations on your mama land. You know what I'm saying? I got a book that was published in 1976 that said that North Carolina was the motherland. Okay. So we're talking Ethiopia. And then you look at the Siraki script. You look at the Siraki script, which just was invented not too long ago, but it's similar to the Amharic script of Ethiopia. So it's like, <laughs> you can't, it's blood. It's in the blood. So we have our, you know, and they said that just like the meta nature was built off of sounds, you know what I mean? And signs of nature and how we spoke, they wrote the way we spoke is how we wrote. That's how I write. When you read my write, when you read my rights or my writs, you read my writs, you're going to talk like this. You know what I'm saying? Like that's, I'm, I'm, I represent hip hop. So I put hip hop on paper in ways that you can learn <laughs> and reference. I, I got reference points. Ports of origin. <laughs> All right, man. I'm going to get off of here, man. And, you know, um, please, you know what I'm saying? If I share this information with you, like, it's not easy to do this, bro. I done lost five sister queens this year. You know what I'm saying? 
at least five sister queens that were near and dear to my heart. You know what I mean? Five sister queens that knew my mother on different levels. You know what I'm saying? At different degrees. Oh, man. So it's not... Um, it's not easy doing this stuff. You know what I mean? But I give praises to the most high. You know what I mean? If you would like to donate um, to the cause or... Uh, just buy our books. That's what we would say. Just go to no more suits LLC.com and buy a book. And just look at that like a, you donating that book to yourself. You feel me? For watching this. In exchange, you know what I'm saying, for our donation. Like, you donating to us. You know what I mean? And in, and in exchange, you donating to us, we gonna donate our book to you. That's the, that's the exchange. That's how we work in no more suits. You know what I mean? You get rid of them Federal Reserve notes and put real books in your crib. That's the real money. You know what I mean? Like, I'm living and breathing. <laughs> so my books got value just because I'm still here living and breathing. And then it's going to appreciate through time. You know what I mean? See, they're out there jamming. They're out there jamming, my nigga. So, yeah, this is the common area, man. Where humans, plants, animals, herbs, you know what I mean? All types of creatures, insects live amongst one another in peace and harmony. That tree right there is so significant. This tree right here is so significant. You know what I mean? Cranes. So this is the this is this is Egypt. This is Kemet. Don't think nothing different, yo. Don't think nothing different. Stop letting people take you away from yourself. You know what I mean? Your home is in your backyard. You know what I mean? Shout out to my guy, Cohen. He was like, I'm not from there, nigga. I'm from Durham, nigga. The Bull City. <laughs> I ain't from, you can't tell me I'm from there. <laughs> I still remember that chop, bill. You know what I'm saying? I fought all homage. Cohen. The Hebrew. The Negro, a Jew. And he looked like you. All right, man. It's time time to restore the land. This is the real restorian. Shalom.